Cruelty became more apparent with every completed objective. I won't lie. It's no coincidence your path crossed his. It seemed a fitting way to allow you... us... to have some amount of revenge. What else can I say? To ease your mind. Your father... He never got to see you grow up. We never did that either. What happened to him was... I've gone over the records of the incident, of course. It seems what happened to him was an unfortunate bit of collateral damage. For many years, I never questioned who my parents were. I accepted my situation... And that was that. With old age comes regret. And asking what if more often. But... What matters now is that you and I have a chance to begin again. What else can I say to ease your mind? So, you're in charge of the Institute? I am the acting director, yes. I spent decades working to reach this point. It's a responsibility I take very seriously. The Institute. It's important. It really is humanity's best hope for the future, no matter what those above ground might think of us. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> They're scared of you, Sean. Scared of the Institute. People are always frightened by what they don't understand. Ultimately, the Commonwealth has nothing to fear from us. Whatever you've seen or heard, I know I can convince you of that. Just give me time. I know there's more for us to discuss. But the Institute is on the verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence would be appreciated as we approach them. I've been a part of something amazing here. I've helped to build a life for myself and the people of the Institute. And now, after all these years, you have an opportunity to help with that. Doesn't that intrigue you? Isn't that what you want? I wasn't paying attention. You want me to stay here in... in the Institute? Yes. That is what I propose. Is it so hard to imagine? The Institute can provide a better life than anything above ground. You've been in the Commonwealth. You've seen what it's like. I assure you that you are better off with us. I don't know. Like, I got a lot of shit to do up there. Hmm. I don't know what to do. I realize that. It's why I'm trying to help you. I hope that you can see that rationally. The Institute is the only thing left in the world that is worth being part of. I simply ask that you give the Institute, me, a chance. A chance to show you what I've been telling you. We really do have humanity's best interests at heart. Will you take that chance? All right, I'll, I'll give you a chance. All right. Thank you. The Institute is now your home as much as it is mine. Please take some time. Get <sighs> Meet the people you'll be working with. You'll want to introduce yourself to the division heads. Dr. Fillmore in facilities. Dr. Ao in SRB. Dr. Holdren in bioscience. And finally, Dr. Lee in advanced systems. They've all been notified of your arrival, of course. Meet them. And then we'll discuss what comes next. God damn it. All right. So I'm going to meet some jackasses. I've got... Hey, there's the, the American flag. Can I open this? I cannot. That is cool cool beans. What do you got? You got can I pickpocket? No? He's got nothing for me to pickpocket. Uh, there's a microphone. Oh. Activate. Guess it's not doing anything. It's a clean globe. Look how clean that is. Look how clean that is. 
Okay, so I am coming right. Map's terrible. This map's terrible. Right, right, right there. Yeah, that's where I'm coming from. Um, so let's put this on the old uh, the Mippity map. Uh, that data. Uh, upload the encrypted message. Um, meet the division leaders. I guess is something we can do right now. I gotta also put a hollow tape or something in something. Hmm. Scissors folder. I mean, I I like the the Commonwealth. Like as as much as a shitty place it is, I I enjoy running around and murdering things. That's just who I am, Sean. That's just who I am. If you can't get past that, well then, uh, I don't know what to tell you. Is there a, this is a shower. I haven't had a shower in forever. Shower. 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 Come on, really? Uh, why is there a folder in here? Oh! Don't mind me! Ah! Uh, oh! Uh, no, nothing, nothing in there. I'd love to have a shower. I mean, we haven't had a, a shower since... Well, it's been over 200 years. Let's just say that. There's... Not a whole lot going on here. There's a lot of bourbon, though. Um, lovely radio music. Muzak. Some kind of Elysium bed. Oh, man. Okay. Oh. A little lighthouse. Okay. I'm just going to see if I can find some peeps. There's, there's no one there. There's all these like weird random holes. This must be Sean's, Sean's apartment. Um, um, they said they wanted me to, to go somewhere. Is this ah? This is this is a thing. Um, you call this a clean floor? Are your visual receptors malfunctioning? Can you not see the grime and dust? Poor synth. Doctor. Can I talk to you? You know what happens when people get robots to do all their work? They get fat and lazy, that's what. I agree. Real people doing real thinking and real work. That's the future I want. Uh... Go if away. that's how you feel, why not leave? Because we could do so much more. And no, everyone is obsessed with these damn synths. It's wasted potential. That's what it is. In any case, I suppose I should say, welcome. You don't have Perhaps to sound so happy fresh about it. Perspective will do some good around here. Don't make excuses. You're clearly defective, mm. and I intend to report this. Perhaps mm. after you've been disassembled, we can use your components to make something that's actually useful. Okay, so there's a guy down there. Oh my god, this place is... This Welcome is really to the enough. Institute, ma'am. Hey, didn't I murder you once? There's, uh... He's down Just there. A routine patrol, ma'am. Wait, you're the, you're the same person. You're the same person that I murdered! And... And saw two seconds ago. I guess it makes sense. If you're a synth. All right. Anything going on in here? I need a, a thing. I need a panel to plug some some stuff into. What a cool apartment! Ah, they have grass or something that's like grass. Oh, bioscience. We uh. Oh my goodness. Alright. Um, 
Oh, it's a gorilla! Oh, there's a few gorillas. Gorilla project is showing promising results. What are you guys doing? Must free the monkeys. You're here. Glad you made it. Am I supposed to talk to you? No, I'm supposed to talk to someone else. We have more than enough to occupy ourselves here. Those people are the last remnants of a dying past. It's best not to dwell on the subject. They're still people, and they're suffering. We can at least admit that it's regrettable. After all, how can we hope to redefine mankind if we can't even hold on to our own humanity? Well, that's a question best left to our colleagues in the robotics division. Yes, well... I suppose you're right. Humanity's future is taking root right here. Oh, aren't you full of vim and vigor? Hey. Hey. Hi, Doc. Welcome. So good to have you here. Dr. Clayton Holdren, head of the Bioscience Division. I can't wait for you to see the work we're doing. It's truly amazing. That guy's freaking out. Ah, not why I'm here. That's great. We'll see. I'll reserve judgment until I know more about it. In that case, let me give you a brief overview of what we do here. As the name implies, the Bioscience Division specializes in fields of study such as botany, genetics, and medicine. Our most important directive is to ensure the health nope. and well-being of everyone in the Institute. To that end, we cultivate highly specialized breeds of flora for use in food and medicine. We've even started to explore the idea of synthetic animal life. You probably saw the gorillas. They're really just a pet project at this point, but the potential is exciting nonetheless. Yeah. Yeah. I can't imagine anything more exciting than fake gorillas. Speaking only for myself, I find them fascinating. Of course, I might be a little biased. <laughs> I'm sure I've taken up enough of your time as it is. But I have to ask, have you decided whether you'll join us? Not sure I'm yet. Not sure. Uh, right now I'm just trying to keep an open mind. It's a big decision, I know. But it's also a rare and important opportunity. No need to rush to judgment. In any case, I imagine you'll want to continue looking around. Or, if you prefer, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. Uh... You mentioned medical care? I might need that from time to time. In that case, you'll want to introduce yourself to Dr. Dean Volkert. He's our top biologist, and also serves as the Institute's resident physician. Dr. Volkert works in the infirmary. Just pay him a visit whenever you need to. You won't find better medical care anywhere else in the Commonwealth. I'll promise you that. And he's done talking to us now. Well, at least he's done talking to us now. Um, we got the gorillas going on. That's a thing. I wonder if there's a, like a panel I can plug that holotape into. Around here. Yeah, somewhere. Hmm. All right, this is this is something. Hmm. Oh, we got all these plates, <gasps> bullets, fusion cells. Really? Hmm. Oh no, I'm gonna get lost. I'm gonna get lost. Oh, well, I can do this. Oh, just a bit more. Just a touch. Sweet. Oh. Don't know where we're going. Okay. Yep. Can you be done? Thank you. Um. Ha 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 ha. I'll take that. I gotta unlock this door too. Yeah, for my next level up, I don't know if I want like the expert lock picking or like the advanced. Got it. Uh, the advanced. Uh, what am I thinking? The the hacky thing, the hacky sacky thing. Push all the buttons. Uh huh. Well, 
I guess that's open. We want to keep it open. Um, are you kidding me? Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know if I, which which hacky thing I want to get. Really, guys, you're gonna shoot me some more? That's not cool. Uh, sort for the. Doesn't okay. Uh, wait, I guess would be the best. Give me some quantum. No, gourd. That should do nicely. Okay, we'll, we'll see if we can. There's ain't nothing detected down here, boys. Scanner's clear. Assaultron. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good. Should I should I like walk? If you walk, you pork and beans. You make less noise. So that's a that's a thing. Um, I could also put on the stealth boy. <laughs> God damn it, there's not even anyone in here. I don't know how long the stealth boy lasts for. Okay, these terminals are kind of a pain in the butt. Um, but I think I figured them out. So you gotta get the letters. So it says there's there's likeness of two. So two of the letters match. Um, so I could do uh, spike. Um, the this will take care of the S and the I. There you go. Turret control. All right. Deactivate turrets. We shouldn't have to deal with any more turrets. Okay. Uh. And uh, should be able to do that. Open the doors. Doors should be open. And that's how long the stealth boy lasts for. Which is not long at all. Take the pale ale bottom. We get some more more health. Did I not take some food? No, I think I only took the stealth boy. Um, yes. All right. Oh my God! The assaultron's kicking my ass. Done. Wow. Wow. Okay. Um, hopefully they're not upset with me about that. Or the fact that I'm snooping where I'm not supposed to. I realized I was supposed to be on my best behavior, but I got lost. I honestly truly got lost. I had no idea where I was going. No one helped me out either. Should I take the pork and beans? Novice lock? I can do that. Oh, come on. What was that? There you go. That's it. Too bad Piper's not here. Oh. Institute loud code, eh? I wonder if I put on the lab coat, if they would, uh, they would have any issues with me. No, nope. I'm one of you. Apparently, uh, apparently not so much with that lab coat. 
Okay, so we'll just put on the, 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 the that one. And I need more aid. 